My name is Tim Cole. I'm the owner of Austin Reptile Service and we're here to talk about how to identify a rattlesnake. It's surprising that most people don't realize that baby rattlesnake is born live with what we call the button, the beginning of the rattle. It's not hard to see, it's very obvious. And when they're first born, they're also born getting ready to shed their skin for the first time. So for about the first 10 days of their lives, they're hanging out with mom and then they shed their skin about day 10 and at that point they form the first segment on the rattle. Also at this point mom scatters, babies scatter and they all go their own way. And this is true with all species of rattlesnakes. So before anybody ever sees them, they're going to have a button, they're going to have a segment. Now you may not hear that when they're shaking because they're so small, but they do have it. That's the easiest way to identify rattlesnakes. Now there is a species of rattlesnake in the Catalina Islands off the coast of California it does not have a rattle. Of course that would be a little bit more difficult to uh, identify but most people aren't going to see the snake anyway. But from coast to coast we do have several species of rattlesnakes in the US and Mexico and South America and they do all have rattles. Now it is possible while they're crawling around outside that the rattle might get caught on something and come off and then that would obviously make it more difficult to identify the snake as a rattlesnake but that doesn't happen very often. So this is how we identify rattlesnakes.